这个时期对 s i n 来讲，就锡克人呢是很大的日子来的，因为是他们庆祝丰收节啊、光明节，叫 Vesaki 的一个时候。Vesaki 对 s i n 来讲，就很像农历新年对华人一样重要，是一个全新的年份。所以很好奇，说他们到底是怎么样去庆祝这个新年的，然后会做些怎么样的节目编排？我们想马上去看一下啊。What does that mean? That's a greeting in the Sikh religion. Oh, I see, I see. We praise to the Sikhs who belongs to the God. All right, so that's the way you guys greet like each yes, other. Yes, yes. The Sikhs in Malaysia, the population is now almost 150 years old. They migrated during the time of the British to work in the army and then also in the police force. Our religion started with Guru Nanak. After Guru Nanak, then there are nine more Gurus. And when it came to the tenth Guru, which is Guru Gobind Singh Ji, the celebration now going on in his honor. Then he baptized the followers of Guru Nanak into the shape we have now as Singhs. So today, uh, it's my first time to be in here for Sing Temple. Okay. I don't know what should I do. You yeah, should really okay. help me. You have to cover your hair like uh, I do. Okay. So we have a cloth. We call it the keski. Keski. Kes means hair. Uh huh. Keski is the cloth to cover the hair. Okay. So All right. I show you how to cover the hair. Okay. So normally Temple will provide this, lah. Normally we do. <laughs> Beautiful. Oh, okay. So actually, what's the reason uh, to cover the, 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 the hair with the we cloth? We believe the hair belongs to the God. In our religion, we don't cut the hair. It's oh, holy. That's why my sink friend, they always leave their hair like so long yes. and then they'll braid it out. Yes. Uh, today, it's the Abasaki uh, period, right? Yes. So uh, normally, what do you guys do? Like, Can you bring me all around? Oh, of course. I'll show you. Normally, when you come, you remove your shoes and then we take the lift up. Okay. Wash our feet and we go into the prayer hall. Okay, so now I have to wash. All right, go, go. So this is the place? Yeah, this is where we wash our feet before we go into the prayer hall. Yeah. We believe we are going to the house of God. Okay, so everything has to be clean. Yes. Okay. 进入锡克庙之前，必须要净身。脱下了鞋和袜子之后，得将双手和双脚都清洗干净的。All right, and then we are set. We are set. Can go in already. Yeah, okay. That's the main prayer hall. Uh huh. It's our darbar set. Darbar set. Yes. I can go in or not? Yeah, we can go in. Uh huh. But we will not be talking inside because there are prayers being going on. Alright. And if you go forward, we will bow to the Guru Granth Sahib. Bow to the Guru Granth Sahib. Uh, the Guru Granth Sahib is our living Guru. And when we bow to it, we give a present. Some people give a ringgit, some people give 10 ringgit, some people give 100 ringgit. Okay. Sikha教徒来到这里,先跪在圣坛前磕头,之后呢,就会在毯子的两侧,洗地而坐。圣坛上面放着的,就是他们的经书了。And we sit also, we have a bow down again, touch the ground, and we listen to the songs and the meanings are on the board. Actually, not uh, reading anything. They just come here and enjoy. Yeah, the Guru they are singing. They are singing actually in the Guru Granth Sahib. Normally, those who concentrate, they close their eyes, and those who know the words, they will sing along. In our religion, we believe we connect with God, with love. God is love. That's what is singing. We give up the materialistic for our love for the God. Then 
we come here and then we take the blessings from the Guru. Everybody will take this. It tastes a little bit like peanut. La. Yeah, this is um, made of flour, sugar and ghee. Mm. Everything is in proportion uh -huh. and they will mix it. It's like a traditional yeah, sink the kind of blessing, blessing. From the Guru. If you have sickness, even it can cure your sickness. Wow. Because the God's word is being sung. Every Sikh temple you go, you will have this. What do you call this in Sikh? Deg. D-E-G. Deg. D-E-G. Deg. I think the smell of it is a bit like a flower. It's a very sweet smell of flower. Although it's used with a tea, but it's not very sweet. And then the smell of it is a bit different. 跟你看的有一点感觉不一样，因为可能感觉你看到的时候呢，它是甜甜腻腻的，可是你吃起来的时候，它其实就是很清香。So Hadith, just now, right when we、uh, just entered the hall, there's a huge kind of like golden arch kind of thingy, right? What's that called? That golden is completely gold, ten kilos of gold、wow. made of, and it's the golden throne for the Guru Granth Sahib. And this golden sengasan is one of the biggest in the world. The other big one is in Bangla Sahib Gurdwara in New Delhi. And the second one, we have it here. Wow! So I saw there's, a, there's, there's this lady there, right? She's doing some kind of things uh, like that. What do you call that's, that? Um, that's Chor Seva. The, the one that she's doing is called Chor. You mean the, the, the tool itself is Chor? Yes, the Chor. Right. Then she's doing a service. We call it Chor Seva. We believe the Guru Granth Sahib is the king of kings. So we are paying respect to him. You know those olden days where the kings will have the fan? So it's something like that. It's your wish that you want to do it, then you can go up and then she will hand it to you. When she hands it to you, she'll you know, touch it on her head. She'll leave it down on there's a, a small bed there. Then she'll move away and another person will take over. But normally in temple, it must be singing. Singing, yeah. Every Sunday we have in the prayer hall, the Darbar Sep, and there is a priest and uh, another person who played the tabla. Uh -huh. They will sing the hymns. That's very interesting. I don't know about that. But there are certain days that they just read the prayers without singing. Also, they have. I am actually a retired uh, medical doctor from UK. I took early retirement uh, four years ago in order to follow my passion for painting. I'm passionate about uh, Sikh painting because of my parents. They directed me into Sikhism. And I love religious music and the stories that I listen to. And I like to paint them. I think traditionally, most of Sikh art has been very uh, rigid and very limited in what the previous painters have presented. And hopefully my art uh, presents Sikh gurus in a normal everyday setting. We hear stories about them, whether they were on their travels, in war, or everyday life scenarios. First instance, they may look like just the normal scenery, but when you look there, you'll find some figures in there. And an average Sikh will recognize, oh yes, that's my guru. I think it's mainly in the last four years that my work has become a bit more widely available, partly because of the internet, uh, Facebook, Instagram, things like that. The people are becoming more aware and also because I'm producing much larger volume of work. Everyone's liked it. And art, as they say, is the beauty of art is in the eye of the beholder. And so different people have like different paintings. And it, I love to see people smiling at my paintings. We walk this way because people are eating food here. So it works out. So in 
呢，他就讲说这里呢这一 part 就是所有的女人啊、妇女啊，他们不只是来吃，他们就在这里 volunteer， 就准备那个蔬菜之类的，你看。Back into that. Ah, oh, okay. So this is the kitchen. Yeah, this is the kitchen. We have one, two, three, four, five cook. All right. Big cook place. Okay. Um, so big. Yeah, because we're serving uh, about a thousand people. This is called pakore. Now they're going to make the pakore here. You know, you go to Indian restaurant, they have the pakore, they will eat with the chutney. chutney. Uh, that's the one. Normally, who's the one that cook all around here? Uh, we have volunteers and we have three cooks. Mostly all the men can cook. Is that? Uh, Not yeah. the ladies? Ladies make chapati. The man normally cooks because it's a big uh, function and the utensils that they use are very heavy. Men will cook the main dishes. The ladies prepare the cutting and all that and the ladies will prepare the chapatis. Chapati is memang your food, right? I mean yes. for sink, it's like a signature dish. They have panel seeds inside, they have cardamom inside, they have tea leaves inside, sugar, milk. That's why it tastes so different, right? It's like your own taste of sink. Uh -huh. But we cannot have it right now. They cannot bring out the food together. Uh -huh. They must wait for all the food to cook. Then they will do a, a Thanksgiving prayer and bring the food for the public to eat. Uh -huh. Before that, they must make sure the food is pure, nobody has touched it. We have a vegetarian meal. Okay. Um, which everybody takes the same food. And we all sit on the floor so that we are all equal. Oh. You don't count your high class or low class, all are equal. Do you guys like actually every day also you guys take chapati? Yes. We are basically from India, from the land of five rivers. We have a staple food is chapati. Okay. There is no rice. Now when we are in Malaysia for so many years, we eat rice. What do you call in uh, like a free free makan? makan langgar. Langgar. Yeah, this is they call this langgar. Every Tuesday they pack about 500 packets of food and serve in the streets to the homeless. We also have people coming here from outside to take food here because food is served every day in this gurdwara, and everything is on donations. The Sikh believe 10% of our income should go towards donation. And this is a traditional food, right? Yeah, it's known as pakore. Pakore. These are their vegetables in the flour. Cabbage, cauliflower, chili. Kacang putih, we always eat that kacang putih, that kind of sweet smell, a little bit of sweet, very nice. And then we add that vegetable, mix it together. It's a very good drink. So they always put it in the kitchen. Do you have any other dishes? Normally we have tea in the early part of the evening. So uh -huh. you don't feel sleepy. Those days, the farmers, they take rest, they will rest in the house before they start doing something else. It's like 
，我们的奶茶，可是呢，它比较干一点，然后呢，又有一点香料的味道在里面。You did mention just now, right, that they can add a little bit of different ingredients in there. Yes, you can actually add in a lot of other things that you like. Oh. Maybe ginger. When our parents came from India those days, we already know that they use these ingredients. Nowadays, they have ready-made ingredients. They call it the tea powder. Ah, oh, no need so ma fan, right? Ah, so ma fan lah. Hello, so this go, so go. So ma, you charm your. Hi, lo. Charm your hair, lo.夜晚时分，越来越多信徒啊，陆陆续续到达西克庙，现场人山人海，非常热闹的。他们首先来到了食堂享用晚餐，一家大小以及亲朋好友们围在一起，大家有说有笑，气氛很融洽。Throughout the day, we have visitors coming here, not only six, but non-six. If you come on a normal day also, you know a lot of European fellows come here, and they are all welcome. They have our vegetarian meal, so they come, they enjoy their food, and then they, they go, they are happy. 吃过晚餐之后呢，大家就会来到祈祷大殿朝拜了。这时的人潮更为拥挤哦。可是呢，大家都很守秩序的排队朝拜，然后席地而坐，静下心来聆听诵经的。This Gurdwara is 100 years old now. It was a small Gurdwara. We had to develop a new one so that it can cater for requirement of our community for the next 100 years. It's one of the oldest in Southeast Asia, you can say. Biggest in Southeast Asia. <laughs> In our religious calendar, the most important date is the birth of Guru Nanak. After that, the second most important date in our calendar is Vesakti. What I'm saying is they celebrated very enthusiastically. So that enables us to keep in touch with our culture. Mr. Inder一家人就已经起身准备梳洗了，然后换上传统的服饰和佩戴各种传统的佩剑。There were five basic requirements for a singh. Hair is a gift of nature to man. Our Guru's belief was whatever nature has given you. You don't undo it. For example, I have a beard. Female doesn't have a beard. So when God has given male a beard, there is a meaning to it. The other thing is like this kada. This is to symbolize that uh, we are supposed to protect the poor. Those days you have to have a sword and all that. Now we symbolically, we are having this. To protect, not only ourselves, but to protect the weak. And the brief we wear. It is to signify that you cannot go around disturbing other people. So this is to remind you that you have to control your uh, sexual desires and all that. And the comb, comb is to clean your hair and all that. 准备就绪之后，先在家中进行膜拜的仪式，接着呢就出发前往西克庙了。和前两天一样，锡克教徒会先到食堂里用餐，再前往祈祷大殿进行诵经膜拜的仪式。唯一不同的就是啊，这一天的诵经仪式完毕之后，锡克教徒就会将经书盖上白布，然后呢，收藏在卧室内。
You see, our religious ceremony, the non-stop of the reading of our holy Granth Sahib, it takes 48 hours and we celebrate all over the world. You will be surprised to know those sick boys and girls and this and that, they never come to the temple. But on the Vaisakhi day, they all come here. Chindian的最后啊,就是山崎里的时刻了。过程中,乐队无间断地演唱着传统的歌曲,一众的信徒则在一旁手握鲜花,默默地祈祷着。旗帜于高空中飘扬，信徒们呢有次序的排队，纷纷撒下鲜花，还有膜拜，寓意新的一年就此开始。Six in Malaysia are still very unique. We are still keep in touch with our culture. Our philosophy is simply this: that all religions are good religions. They are like different rivers leading to the same ocean. Let's go. My name is Hadif Kaur. I'm 58 years old. Vasaki to me is important because I see Sikhs from all over the country unite under one roof. Today,很开心,虽然说是真的很累,因为一大清早,然后呢,到晚上天黑了,是很累,可是那个感觉是非常良好的,不管是受访者啊,还是一些路过的性朋友,他们真的是很humble的在跟你做聊天的这个动作,